Hi friends, welcome to Tabletop Tonight. I'm Ruel. And I'm Michelle. And on the tabletop right now is Junk Drawer. Michelle, just like our, the rooms in our home, there are uh, many junk drawers and these are two of them that need to be filled up. Uh, there's plenty of junk and are you ready to clean things up? Oh, absolutely. All right, so <laughs> it's a towel laying game, folks, uh, with polyominoes, one of our favorite mechanisms. Um, these are uh, variable scoring cards. We're going to go with the easy mode so y'all can uh, learn how to play, but there are plenty of these in the box that you swap in and out. Basically, what you're doing, you have four elements to your uh, junk drawer, four boxes, and we're going to turn over item cards one at a time. The items correspond to your polyomino pieces, and you're going to place them in one of these squares. Each of them scores differently. You're going to place four, um, four uh, tiles in the four boxes per round. And at any time, if you cannot place a tile, the game is over and we go to scoring. So let's take a look at how the uh, game scores. This one here in the left top corner is don't cover center and corner spaces. So as long as the corner and the center space is open, you'll get three points per. The top right Cover many spaces. These here, as long as you cover a space, it's worth a point. So the more you cover it, the more points you get. Unlike this one here, this one here, uh, don't cover many spaces. All the uncovered spaces you get one point per. So it's basically the opposite of the one on top of it. And finally, cover perimeter spaces. Only the perimeter spaces, the one on the edge here, are worth one point per. Okay, we've shuffled up the item deck. Michelle and I have all our junk here ready to get in the junk drawers. Michelle, are you ready to clean things up? I am so ready. <laughs> this is Michelle's jam. Folks, we're going to start off with some earphones. So you find the earphones. Um, I found mine. That's the jagged looking one. <laughs> Where do I want to put this? Yeah, so cover let's see. Many cover spaces. many spaces. Cover perimeter. And this is a pretty big piece. So I'm going to go with cover many spaces. I do perimeter. Mm -hmm. Well, there's other ones that'll cover more. Yeah. Okay, so cover many spaces. I am also going to do that one. Okay. And then we go to the next item. It's the charm bracelet. bracelet. That's our pug Meeple barking around. For some reason, she loves to start barking when we start filming videos. It's just, <laughs> her, it's just her jam. Huh, Meeps? Okay, so I think I'm going to put that one here. Okay, and I've gone to go for my spaces. The third one. Yeah, it's blue stick meatball. Blue stick. Uh, cover perimeter spaces for me. That'll go good here. Oh, wait, I need to put it this way. <laughs> and finally, the button. Oh, that would have been a great one for this. Don't cover any space. And that's oh just going to go. Goodness. Don't cover center or corner for me. Okay. Uh, there. Hey, we put it. Okay, so yeah, um, now the round is over. We discard these here. Meeple. But she's barking at one of the games. Oh no. What do you want to play, Meeple? One, two, three. She wants to play four. Juicy Fruits. All right. <laughs> we'll play that later, uh, Meeps. First one out is the can opener. Can opener. Which is this one here. I, I want to take many spaces. I will also put this. No, I'm going to put this on the perimeter. Okay. Next one out okay. is the flashlight. Oh, that's the one I want for cover many spaces. Um, oh, this would be a good perimeter. One. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And the next card out is the watch. That's a straight one. So again, remember, folks, as you place these, you can only place them once. So even though this would fit here, I've already placed a flashlight, so I have to go to a different spot cover this time. center and corner. Did you put yours in the same yeah, I did. Oh, <laughs> okay. And Different the direction. final one, yeah, the, for this round, the inhaler. The inhaler, because that's <coughs> a good spot for your inhaler in the junk drawer. <laughs> I know, right? I'll go here. I have to go here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we discard these, and we draw four more. And as you can see, friends, this is a pretty quick game, especially uh, when you have a pug barking in the background. Makes it go that much faster, huh, Meeple? All right. First one out for this round, Michelle, is Bottle Opener. Oh. That's the one that looks like a T. Okay. I'm trying to get the treats to Meeple, but Mookie's oh. too fast. <laughs> Mookie. Mookie. Okay. And, I'm sorry, Bottle Opener? Bottle Opener, yeah. So we'll use that for bottle? You. Oh, that's a Bottle Opener? Yep. Wine Bottle Opener, right? Yeah. Well, because I, I think of a Bottle Opener as like the... Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, this thing. <laughs> the flat thing. Yep. Okay. 
Um, I think I can use this for perimeter. Don't cover. Okay, and cover my own spaces. But if I do this, okay, oh, I, oh, that's going to cover a corner though. Yeah, I ran into that same problem, so I had to go somewhere else with mine. Yeah. Okay. Cover many spaces. That might be a good place. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, I'm going to do that one. Okay. Second item in this round is our coins. Coins. This one looks like a Z. Oh, oh. I put that there though. I don't know. I don't know if I like that there. Okay, so so my corners are still good. So is my center. Okay. Gosh, I don't know if I like that. I'll go over here. Okay. Uh phone charger. Charger. Okay. Oh, I did that already. Darn it. Okay. Cover perimeter spaces. And I hope it's a small one. Yeah, same. Flash sure. drive. Okay, that works. I can still save my thing here. Okay, next round we discard this junk. And hi, phone, Michelle. We are starting to fill up our drawers a little bit more. I'm feeling a little more zen because <laughs> <laughs> this makes me crazy. Yeah, let's uh, put in batteries. Batteries. I don't know about this. I'm Ouch. in trouble, I think. I've like, got oh a God. pug on my leg here. Oh, no, Meeps. This is Mookie. Okay, perfect. Yeah, you know what? That one works. Okay, you know what? I'll just go like this. Okay. Uh, Tape. That's this one. I can do this and cover many spaces. That worked out perfectly. That's where I'm putting it. Okay, and the pencil. Okay, that's a good one. Okay, so okay, batteries, oh. tape, pencil. Okay, a little perimeter on this one. There. Okay. And the final one this round are the sewing materials. <laughs> okay. All right, getting close to the end here. Remember, folks, once one of the players cannot place an item, then uh, the round the game ends. So let's see what happens here. Sunglasses. Sunglasses. So that won't fit there. That won't fit there. It can fit here or here. Oh, this is gonna go where I don't want it to go. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, well, it is what it is. Yeah, I was so close to doing the same thing, but I ended up putting on my perimeter instead. The sunglasses. Yeah, it wouldn't, it wouldn't fit, fit on mine. Yeah. Okay, getting real close to the end. Uh, bag clips. And I cannot place that, so this is the end of the game. Oh, you must place I can't it either. Okay, game over. All right. Oh. <laughs> so we both uh, did okay. Uh, now we go to the scoring, folks. We're going to score each section. So the first one, the top left, don't cover any center mm -hmm. or corner spaces. Those are worth three points for the corners, three points for the middle. One, two, three, four, five for 15 for me. And one, two, oh! Oh, the middle! <laughs> but you got the corners for 12. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, then cover many spaces. All the spaces covered in that top right are worth one point. So. Six, seven, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 for Michelle. I think I got the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, oh wow. A little better. Um, and then... How are you getting 20? 1, 2, 3, four, Oh, yeah, because 1, 2, 3, 4. It's a 5 by 5, five so by five. Never mind. I thought it was 4 by 4. Okay. So, wait, how many... <clears throat> so, you have 5 left over? Yeah. I also have 5, so you, you should have 20. Oh. I mean, uh, yeah, 20. Oh, because I was counting 4 by 4, so... Oh, uh, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. 20. All right. Close game. Uh, cover the perimeter spaces. Only the perimeters are worth one each. Six, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I got fifteen. Let me double check. 
We got the pug in the background barking, folks. One, two, three, four, five, six, yes, seven, eight, me. nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. And Michelle? I think um, we have fifteen, 15 as well. Yes. Five, six, seven, eight, 10. nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh, yeah, so I have thirteen. <laughs> okay, thirteen. Oops, thirteen goes here. This was not my finest hour again. <laughs> yeah, same. Okay, now this is the uncovered ones are worth a point. Two, four, six. Six for Michelle, seven for me. Okay, 30, 57 for Ruel, and uh, 22, 35, 40, wait, it's like 32, 45, 51 for Michelle. Six point oh, one. wow. Very close. I thought it was going to be a bigger span between. <laughs> it, it was a close one. As you can see, folks, we both pretty, did a pretty good job of filling up our junk drawers. Unfortunately, this one's where you didn't want as many. We both sort of went overboard there. But, you know, that's what's cool about this game. Uh, it forces you to make some tough choices. And for a light uh, top lane game, I thought it was cool. Now, this is your first time playing it. How'd you like it? I like it. Well, I'm a big fan of polyominoes. Yeah. So we, these we both are. Right and, yep. and organizing. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. Organizing, tile lane, polyominoes. This is Michelle's Jam. Uh, thank you for joining us, folks. Again, please hit that like and subscribe button. And until next time, we'll see you here on Tabletop tonight. Bye, everybody. Bye.